Hi everybody, John JMC here. Um, I've had a couple of questions with regards to the uncoupling ramps that I use in my station. Um, so I thought I'd do a quick little video uh, with regards um, to the actual ramps themselves. So they are just the standard Pico um, SL29 uh, ramps. Uh, and quite literally, you can see it there in the platform and it's a case of it just literally drops into the sleepers you can fix them in um but i've obviously left them loose just so i can do it and as you can see there it's basically just a little spring there's no sort of tension to it or anything like that it's quite a, a free sort of item but the way it works is a case of because it's tension lock when a locomotive pulls a rake of stock over them it's locked it's a case of it can't come undone so for instance if i get my 08 john and we run it over the actual uncoupling ramp now so it will be coming into shot in a second do bear with it um, here it comes it's a case of as it passes over because the coupling's under tension nothing will happen I'm just going to stop it there and stop what now happens is because when you reverse it it's now a case of you're pushing it and the tension locks um, are not basically locked in place as you pass the coupling over, excuse me, I'll head the right way in a second. As you pass the locomotive over the uncoupling ramp now, because there's no tension and effectively the tension lock couplings are not locked together, if you stop it in the right place, it's now a case of the tension lock hooks themselves are now actually up in the air. I don't know how well you can see that on camera, but what I'll do now is I'll pull forward and as you can see. And that's it. it it's, it's very simple. Um, it's very easy to do. Um, the only thing I would consider is obviously with like, for instance, the coaches here, um, I've basically got a rake of four that are fixed rakes. So I use the magnetic couplings, the Hunt um, um, West Hill Wagon Work ones. Um, they're basically linking the fixed rake together and then I use the tension locks at each end. So yeah, that's basically it. Nothing clever, nothing fancy, just a simple little piece of plastic that basically just pushes up when the tension locks are basically not locked under tension. I hope that helps, guys. Uh, thanks again for watching. Really do appreciate it. Take care. Bye-bye.